Ladies and gentlemen, our last match of today is from Group B. Slovenia versus the reigning champion, the United States, two unbeaten teams. Let's see who's going to win this derby tonight. Let's start with introducing, please welcome the teams, starting with Team USA! Number four, Kyle Boswell. Number five, Colby Williams. Number six, the captain, Eric Damien Jr. Number seven, Ian Jackson. Number eight, Mark Armstrong. Number nine, Miles Colin. Number ten, Daniel Inman Harper. Number eleven, Toby Avoca. Number twelve, Trent Johnson. Number thirteen, Ben Allen Lubin. Number fourteen, Asa Newell. And number fifteen, Omaha Bigia. Head coach of the United States, Thomas Marty Boyle. Assistant coaches are Mel Rice and Michael Boynton. And now, please welcome Team Slovenia! Number four, Arne Osoidi. Number five, Bukashi Tolanovic. Number six, Jan Zemic. Number seven, Jan Pide. Number eight, Nal Berko. Number nine, the captain, Alan Sulic. Number ten, Tsurta Kachadilo. Number eleven, Miha Mischek. Number twelve, Sergei Matura. Number thirteen, Kaspar Kocera. Number fourteen, Kaspar Skolia. And number fifteen, Blas Rafa. Head coach of Slovenia, Daniel Radosavljevic. After the coaching, Boston, uh, Boston Shifra and Domen Drobre. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the officials, the referees, Leonardo Salazar, Argentina, Peter Prox, Hungary, and Carlos Vélez, Colombia, and our FIBA technical delegate is from Togo, Esteban Azar, Bioina, Gungu. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the national anthem of USA. Please remain standing for the national anthem of Slovenia. Hello and welcome into Funix Arena in Debrecen, Hungary for the 2023 FIBA U19 Basketball World Cup. My name is Craig Feta and I'll be with you for this Group B matchup between Slovenia and USA.
again, hello and welcome into Phonics Arena in Debrecen, Hungary for the 2023 FIBA U19 Basketball World Cup. My name is Craig Beta and I'll be with you for this rookie matchup between Slovenia and the defending champion USA. As we look at the starting lineup for Team USA. A completely different starting lineup for Tad Boyle in this one. Island Boswell, Cody Williams, Tobey Awaka, Trey Johnson, and Asa Newell. Yesterday against Madagascar, Boyle started Eric Daly Jr., Mark Armstrong, Billy Harper, Ben Allen Lubin, and Omaha Bilyeu. And now for the starting lineup for Slovenia. Be Arne Osoynik, Jan Simic, Jan Vide, Sergei Matsura, and Jasper Mocheva. Our officials for this contest Leonardo Salazar of Argentina, Peter Prosch of Hungary, and Carlos Velez of Colombia. We're so glad you can be with us wherever you're tuned in from around the world. This might be a little different style of broadcast than you might be used to. I'll be interacting live with those of you watching on our YouTube stream. I'll be responding to questions and comments, so I may not be hitting on every play on the floor. And if you do engage in the YouTube chat, we just ask that you keep it friendly and respectful, and we will all have a good time. In addition to YouTube, you can check us out on Facebook and Instagram at NextGenOops for additional content aimed at the future basketball stars around the world. You can also check out the official tournament website, u19worldcup.basketball. And when you share or comment on this game or this tournament, use the hashtag FIBAU19. Alex Stare says, is for Slovenia. Go ahead, if you haven't already, let us know where you're watching from in our YouTube live stream chat. Maybe we'll give you a shout out. One other game going on right now. Madagascar leads Lebanon 26-14 with 7.34 to play in the second quarter. Bunch of games already in the books. Run those down for you. Japan defeated Egypt 82 70. Serbia over Brazil 74 72. Spain over France 88 69. Canada defeated China 88 79. Hungary in a thriller over Argentina 67 66. And the game that I brought you just a little while ago Turkey defeated Korea 91 76. Ball is in the air, and we are underway. Asa Newell wins the tip for USA. And the defending champs are on offense first. Boswell getting it to Newell. Newell, the left-hand jump hook, no good. Newell, along with Ian Jackson, were on the Team USA U-17 World Cup squad last year actually faced Slovenia. Jan Vide and Lars Tratar are on the Slovenian roster that faced USA last year. So pressure in the backcourt now from the Americans. Slovenia on their first offensive possession. Nice feed on the cut, and the lay-in is up and good. Jan Vide. And the first point by Jan Vide. Here's 
Trey Johnson over into the corner for Newell. Newell down to Awaka. Awaka spins toward the bucket, hangs and hits. Tough shot by Tobe Awaka. Tobe Awaka. Awaka out of the University of Tennessee. Now Slovenia getting the offense set up. Eight to shoot. Long three-pointer on the way, back iron, no. Rebound grabbed by Cody Williams. Here comes USA. And now they back it out. Boswell works his way into the lane. Right-hand finger roll is up and in. Peter Boswell. Lob up ahead to Cody Williams. Looks like they were trying to set up the alley oop, but Cody Williams just said, I'll just grab it on the floor and take it up nice and easy. Seven to shoot for Slovenia. Zimic, right side to Matsura. Shot will not count. Slovenia with the shot clock violation. Six two in favor of USA. Off day tomorrow for the tournament. USA will take on Madagascar. I beg your pardon, they will take on Lebanon. Defeated Madagascar yesterday. Left hand layup up and in. And Slovenia back to within two. That was Jan Semic. USA will take on Lebanon Tuesday while Slovenia will take on Madagascar. Madagascar and Lebanon playing right now in Group B. With Madagascar on top. 4.43 to play in the second quarter, 31-24. Right side to Newell. Shot clock at six. Cody Williams. His floater from 14, no, gets his own rebound, has it blocked. There for the follow is Trey Johnson. He's got his first point. Beg your pardon, that was Toby Awaka. Tar Heel story checking in, watching from North Carolina, cheering for Team USA. Thanks so much for joining us. Three from the corner is up and good. And now Slovenia to within one at 8-7. Love inside, Toby Awaka. It's whistled for up and down. Left his feet, came back down, called for the travel. So Slovenia on offense, looking for their first lead of this game. Inside six and a half minutes to play first quarter. Gets reset into the corner. Five to shoot. The hanger is up and good. Arnea Soynik gives Slovenia the lead at 9 8. Here's the drive by Boswell. Got the defender in the air, but couldn't do anything. Trey Johnson now. Shot clock at six. His long jumper no good. Rebound. Vita was fighting for it. But Tobe Awaka grabbed it and put it up and in. And now it's USA back on top. 10-9. Coming up on the halfway point of this first quarter. The floater by Vida. No good, but it's out of bounds. And it'll be Slovenia ball. First subs into the game now. So 
So it's Slovenia ball to inbound. On the floor now for USA, Mark Armstrong, Omaha Bill U. Eric Daly and Ian Jackson joining Tobey Awaka. Vida with a pretty hanger in the lane. Put the brakes on and elevated, and Slovenia back on top, 11-10. Daly, right side to Bilyeu. He spins his way toward the bucket, loses the handle, and it goes out of bounds. It'll be Slovenia ball. Pressure in the backcourt now by Eric Daly Jr. Stolen away by USA. And another steal at the other end. As Omaha Bilyeu tried to go behind the back, had his pocket picked. And then a foul called. Almost thought for a moment that might be a breakaway, but too many players behind the play evidently. So Slovenia looking to extend their first lead of the game. Beautiful feed inside. That is up and good. Sergei Matsura with Slovenia up three. Over to Ian Jackson. Jackson hangs from 10 feet, and that is good. Tough shot by Ian Jackson. He had 17 points, three rebounds, three assists, and two steals in the win against Madagascar yesterday. Five to shoot for Slovenia. They lose it. Up ahead now to Daly. Daly goes up and jams it. And USA regains the lead, 14-13. And Slovenia wants timeout. Head coach Daniel Rudoslovic. Actually, there was no timeout there. Shot block. Not sure if that was Eric Daly or Van or Van Allen Lubin that got a piece of that. There at the other end, USA nearly lost it. Ian Jackson gets it back out, swings it around. Daly for three, missed. And Jan Vita said that should be a goaltend call in addition to the foul. So Vida will go to the free throw line. He was four of six from the strike yesterday. Gasper Kocheva sits down. Miha Musik is on now for Slovenia. And the first free throw by Vida is up and in. Second one for Vita rings out, and we are tied at 14. 3.15 to play, first quarter. Open pull-up jumper missed. And it's out of bounds to Slovenia. I beg your pardon, that was off of Slovenia, so USA retains possession. And a reach-in foul on Sergei Matsura. I beg your pardon, that was on Arne Osoyne. So 
So Asoynik sits down. Vukashin Todorovic comes on for Slovenia. Nice move by Mark Armstrong, but he has his shot blocked. Now Baloo missing high off the glass and a whistle following that shot. USA whistled for the foul, 2.49 to play first quarter. Don't forget to subscribe to FIBA the Basketball Channel on YouTube to search FIBA U19 World Cup and then subscribe don't miss a minute of this event as well as some other great events that we have coming up throughout the rest of the summer Sergei Matsura hits the three-pointer with Slovenia leads by three now Armstrong launches a three of his own a little too strong rebound grabbed by Van Allen Lubin Eric Daly could not save the rebound, and that will be Slovenia ball. 2-11 to play first quarter. Last two games of the day underway. This one between Slovenia and USA at Phonics Arena. And Madagascar and Lebanon playing at Ola Gabor. Two minutes now. Shot is blocked, but a foul called before the block. Eric Daly showing some ups to get up there. Blocked that shot, but... Foul is going to be on Van Allen Lubin. Got beat to his left. And so Gasper... Gasper Skorjans will go to the free throw line. Skorjans has not shot a free throw yet in this tournament, and he misses his first. Second free throw too strong, rebounded by Lubin. Here we look at Mark Armstrong, 19 year old from Villanova. Now here's Daly on the drive, loses his footing and backs it out. Six to shoot, now five, calling for some help. Takes it himself, banks it in. Tough take by Eric Daly Jr. Captain scores to get USA back to within one, 17-16. Todorovic up top, getting it back to the left wing. Shot clock at three. Long three on the way, well short. Daly snatches that one out of midair and a whistle. 13 fouls, Slovenia. Don't forget for additional content aimed at all of these outstanding young athletes on both the men's and women's side. Content directed at the future stars of international basketball. Check us out on Facebook and Instagram at Next Gen Hoops. And when you comment and share tournament information, Use the hashtag FIBA U19. 50 seconds to play now in this first quarter. The drive by Armstrong comes up just short. Slovenia on the run. Bounce pass inside to Zimic, and he scores. Miha Misek! your pardon, that was Miha Music. Fourteen fouls, 
Slovenia commits the foul with 29 seconds to play in this first quarter. And it's going to be USA ball coming out of the sideline. Armstrong to inbound. Kick out, three on the way. No good, but the offensive rebound by Van Allen Lubin. He can't connect on the putback. 15 seconds to play in the first quarter. Slovenia holding for the last shot. Here's Todorovic. Lost it on the way up. Couldn't decide if he was going to shoot it or pass it. Ended up doing neither. So at the end of the first quarter, Slovenia leads Team USA 19-16. We are back live from Phonix Arena in Debrecen, Hungary at the 2023 FIBA U19 basketball. Get a look at the first quarter shooting numbers. USA 57% from two point range, 22% from three. USA out rebounding Slovenia 13 to seven. I was going to say, I don't think that three point numbers were right. I don't recall USA hitting one in that first quarter. They are indeed 0 of 5 from beyond the arc. Slovenia 2 of 4. Slovenia 8 of 13 for 61 percent overall. USA 8 of 22 for 36 percent. Sergei Matsura, the leading scorer for Slovenia after one quarter, he's got eight points. Probably Awaka has six for USA. Just underway, second quarter. Glad you can be with us wherever you're tuned in from as Slovenia extends. 21-16 now. Now a three from USA from the wing. No good. Rebound Slovenia. Looking to extend this three-point advantage. Shot blocked! Asa Newell from behind. And then Cody Williams has his shot blocked at the other end. Jan Vide, 18-year-old UCLA product, gets his left hand on that one and sends it out of bounds. Slovenia turns it over. USA working it around. And a foul before the shot. That's going to be on 
Miha Musik. Fadeaway is up and good for Kylan Boswell. Gorgeous shot there. And USA back to within three. Newell tracks it down in the corner. Goes to the other corner, Cody Williams for three. That misses. Rebound to Slovenia. Eight minutes to play, second quarter. Outside to Zulic. He takes it in, draws the foul. So Alan Zulic will go to the free throw line. He was 0 for 2 from the stripe there yesterday. Has not attempted a free throw in this game. By the way, if you have not already, let us know in the chat where you're watching from. Give you a shout out on the air. More than 12,000 people watching right now. 486 likes on our broadcast. If you have not already, go ahead and give us that thumbs up. Let's see if we can get to 1,000 for this game. Sure, appreciate all the engagement so far. in Greece, one in Tunisia. The is good. Chad watching in Spartanburg, South Carolina. Jakob in Slovenia. You are in Lithuania, Pakistan. Yana watching from Finland. Gerardo watching in Tucson, Arizona. Chris in Toronto. Sorry, we can't get to everybody. We'll try to do as many shout outs as we can. Again, a little bit different style of a broadcast than you might be used to. Trying to engage on social media with as many people as we can during the course of the game. Answering questions and comments. Zulic for three. Splash that! Captain Alan Zulic gives Slovenia a nine-point lead, 29-20. Six and a half minutes to play in this second quarter. by Boswell no good here comes Slovenia back the other way here is in the Czech Republic in Poland and if you were in Italy Spain another one from Greece Tim's watching in Singapore beautiful up and under would not finish for Zulic and here comes USA back the other way soaring layup Good by Cody Williams. Cody Williams. And now a timeout on the floor. USA trailing by 7, 29, 22. 5.51 to play, second quarter.
Welcome back to Phonics Arena in Debrecen, Hungary. It's the 2023 FIBA U19 Basketball World Cup. My name is Craig Fade. I hope you've been enjoying this one so far. Slovenia on top of Team USA, 29-22. Nearing the midway point of the second quarter. One other game going on right now. Madagascar and Lebanon. Madagascar leading 38-30 at halftime. We'll run down some of the other scores in just a moment. Three on the way from Todorovic. No good. Rebound grabbed by Asa Newell. If you are watching in Ireland on our YouTube live stream, tip in up and good by Newell. If you're from Kansas City, thank you for enjoying the interactive broadcast. Yeah, that's what... What FIBA likes to do for the, and granted this is a senior level game at U19, but in the youth tournaments and at the U19 level, they like to have the broadcasters following along in the YouTube chat, answering questions and responding to comments. So you see the replay on the foul by Alan Zulic. Bilal watching from Turkey. Tom from Loveland, Colorado. Back outside, pass stolen by Zulic. Here comes Slovenia, pull up three. No good, and the rebound out of play as it goes up and over the backboard into the support. Substitution for both sides. USA number eight, Mark Armstrong. Hamza Selvi, Selvi saying go Slovenia. William watching from Sweden. Sweet Potato cheering for Slovenia. Cryo watching from Indonesia. Josiah from Salina, Kansas. Or is it Salina? I can't remember. Thomas Petty from North Carolina. Yanobi asks... Can USA crack triple digits in this game? We shall see. USA put up 136 against Madagascar yesterday. Held to just 24 through a quarter and a half against Slovenia. Slovenia yesterday defeated Lebanon 74-58. Viewers all over. Alabama in the U.S., Senegal, Tunisia, New Zealand, Bulgaria, Greece, India. Just amazing. Toronto checking in as well. Glad everybody can be with us. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that thumbs up. Oh, my! Soaring in for the dunk. Wow. Sergei Matsura just going up and thundering that one. As we see a foul committed there by Jan Zimic. Zemic, I should say. Sorry, still working on some of these names. It's tough going back and forth from different countries and different pronunciations. Different accents. So far in this tournament, I've done Turkey twice, South Korea, China, now Slovenia, and USA. Did Argentina as well yesterday. OG Vlog says USA should do a full court press. What are they waiting for? Well, we shall see. 
George says greetings from New Jersey. Three on the way. Splash that one! Arne Osoynik! And Slovenia back up by nine, 34-25. Inside three and a half minutes to play in this second quarter. Evan is watching from Torrance, California. That left hand three is up and good by Dylan Harper. Nothing but the bottom of the net for Harper. And with 3.15 to play in the second quarter, Slovenia takes timeout. Question in the chat from Tony asking if I'm going to be upcoming, rather broadcasting, the upcoming Basketball World Championship in August. I have not gotten any assignment for that tournament just yet. Still a couple of months off. Thirty-four twenty-eight, Slovenia leading USA. Three oh five to play in the second quarter. Long three-pointer as the shot clock winding down, no good. And finally snatched out of the air by Cody Williams. Foul on the play and. Addressing some of the information in the chat here. This is a different style of broadcast. FIBA wants us to be more interactive with the folks engaging on social media, specifically the YouTube live stream chat. So, doing some shout outs, reading some comments. If it's not your cup of tea, that's fine. The floater. Oh, my. Up and good. Jan Vide. And pardon, that was Sergei Matsura. He's having himself a nice game. Ten points already. Layup by Mark Armstrong. Misses. And now at the other end. Oh, my. Slovenia running now. Out to a ten-point lead. Whistle. Don't know if they're going to count that last bucket by USA. Heard the heard the whistle. Slovenia saying they called timeout. As we look at the two-hand stuff by Matsura off of the feed from Vita. character, unique chemistry, 
FIBA Basketball World Cup is the peak of the game. It's the toughest competition in the basketball world to win. That is why I will be there. Because when you win for one, you win for all. Welcome back to Phonics Arena in Debrecen, Hungary. Team USA trailing by 10 as we approach the two-minute mark in this second quarter. Dylan Harper gets fouled, and he'll go to the line for a pair. 15 fouls the way he A lot of folks from all over the world checking in. Yuki watching from Nepal. Emmanuel from Jeddah in Saudi Arabia. Jerry watching from Tucson, Arizona in the USA. Amit watching from Nepal. Get a look at the USA coaching staff. Second free throw in for Dylan Harper. Lyrics master watching from the Philippines as well. Some pressure in the backcourt now, and Sergey Matsura travels. Luke watching from Bologna in Italy. Obet from Mexico. Question in the chat who I'm rooting for to win. I don't root for anybody during a game. I try to show enthusiasm when both teams do something well. Even if it's Team USA playing. Like the fact that I am American and broadcasting from America, I do not bias my comments in favor of the American team. I try to call it fair, I try to be enthusiastic for both teams when they do something good. Jay is watching from India, three-pointer well short for Dylan Harper. Trent Boy watching from Fontana, California. Pettit from Leipzig in Germany. Kaunas, Lithuania. Habertown, Pennsylvania. Tarnoff, Poland. My goodness, everybody's checking in from all over. Coming up on one minute to play. Slovenia leading Team USA by nine. USA running now. A four on one. Alley oop. Eric Daly goes up and jams it home with two hands on the alley oop, and will that spark USA on an offensive run? 40 seconds to play in this second quarter. Bounce pass to Blotz Tratar. Second team for USA. He gets fouled. That's going to be on Mark Armstrong. Your pardon, looks like it was going to be on Eric Daly. As Dylan Harper has a seat. Tim's watching from Sun City, Arizona. John James asks my favorite NBA player. Well, of course, I have to go with the all-time GOAT, Mr. Michael Jeffrey Jordan. <laughs> Luis checking in from Brazil. Second free throw short. Rebound grabbed by Daly. Less than 30 seconds to play. USA trailing by seven.
Pull up Jay from the right elbow, no good by Daly. And Slovenia will play for the final shot. Sweet watching from Bulgaria. Igor cheering for Slovenia. Five seconds left. USA making it difficult for Slovenia to get off the final shot. Three-pointer nearly banked in. And at the end of two quarters, Slovenia on top of USA by the score of 40 to 33. This is the 2023 FIBA U19 Basketball World Cup live from Phonics Arena in Debrecen, Hungary. We are back with second half action in just a few moments. character you need chemistry FIFA basketball World Cup is the peak of the game it's the toughest competition in the basketball world to win that is why I will be there because when you win for one you win for all
You need character. You need chemistry. FIFA Basketball World Cup is the peak of the game. It's the toughest competition in the basketball world to win. That is why I will be there. Because when you win for one, you win for all. Welcome back to Phonics Arena in Debrecen, Hungary. It's the 2023 FIBA U19 Basketball World Cup. My name is Craig Feta. Hope you've been enjoying this one so far. If you are a fan of Team Slovenia, you sure have been. As Slovenia leads USA coming out of the halftime, 40-33. to Way here in the second half. My name is Craig Feta. Thanks so much for joining us. Wherever you're watching from around the world on Next Gen Hoops or our YouTube live stream. USA looking to get back into this one. Three pointer is up and in. Asa Newell with a pretty left hand stroke gets USA back to within four. 40 37. If you're just joining us on our YouTube stream, as Jan Vide goes up for the dunk. USA another three-point attempt missed. Asa Newell the rebound. Again, if you're just joining us, a little bit different style of broadcast than you might be used to. We're interacting with the folks on the live stream in the chat. Give us a shout out wherever you're watching from. A lot of great questions and comments about the development of youth basketball in Europe versus USA. Head fake that Kylan Boswell doesn't buy. Boswell now lobs it inside to Tobe Awaka. A foul as the defender went over the back. And they're going to call it unsportsmanlike. Falcon Howard watching in Indiana in the USA. Watching from Slovenia. Watching from Michigan. Silver watching from Portugal. Both free throws good, and Slovenia will get the ball.
Slovenia back on top by eight. And is that going to be counted as a goaltend? You see. Hard to tell from that angle. No goaltend, but a foul was called. First free throw for Sergei Matsura is up and good. Justin watching from the Philippines. Ed watching from Dublin in Ireland. Jose watching from Portugal. Audit watching from New Hampshire. Step back three for Kylan Boswell, no good. Rebound tracked down in the corner by Toby Awaka. He saves it in. Outside now, Boswell thought about the three. Gets into the paint. Gets it back outside, two to shoot. And did he get it off? Didn't matter because Slovenia got the rebound. You were watching from Istanbul in Turkey. And a steal by Team USA. Arios watching from Athens. USA dribbled that off their foot. And Slovenia up ahead. Reverse layup attempt blocked by Asa Newell. Here comes USA back the other way. Trailing by 10. Stolen away by Slovenia. Aliyub comes up just short. Not quite enough in the springs for Sergei Matsura on that alley-oop. So it's going to be a USA ball. Ricky watching from Papua New Guinea. If you were in Toronto. Nikos watching from Cyprus. Wang watching from Taiwan. Yeehaw asks where I am from. I am in Bloomington, Illinois. About 125 miles south southwest of Chicago. Pretty jump hook there by Toby Awaka. Toby Awaka. USA back to within eight. Matsura has 14 for Slovenia. Jan Vida with 13. No USA scorers in double figures. Eric Daly has eight. Toby Awaka has eight. And a three-pointer there. Oh, my goodness, Jan Zemic with Slovenia up now 11, their biggest lead of the game. Daly's three-pointer missed. Rebound put up and in by Tobe Awaka. Now Awaka has 10 points. Simeon wants a shout out for Bulgaria, sure. Glad to see you're watching from Bulgaria. Shout out to all the people watching from Massachusetts as well. Jonas watching in Manchester. USA looking to cut this lead, little hesitation move. Floater won't go, rebound by Matsura. USA is not intimidating Slovenia at all. Question in the chat asking me who my favorite in this tournament is. Obviously USA coming in as the favorite, but Slovenia showing they can hang with them. Turkey looks pretty impressive as well. Yeehaw watching from Evanston, Illinois, home of Northwestern University. Our FIBA mod in the room asks if we're going to get to 1,500 likes. I think we can. We've got more than 14,000 folks watching right now on our YouTube live stream. Not to mention, we don't know how many more hundreds watching on Next Gen Hoops. Nathan watching from Dubai. Gio watching a shout out from Georgia. 
Zach said Spain has got to be the favorites now. They put a whooping on France. That was... The win might not necessarily have been unexpected, but the manner in which they did it certainly was. You were in Albania. Another three up by Slovenia that missed. Coming up on five minutes to play in this third quarter. If you haven't already, head over to Next Gen Hoops on Facebook and Instagram. For additional content on all of these great players on both the men's and women's side, as Tobey Awaka gets the follow. Awaka, 19 years old, plays collegiately at the University of Tennessee. Pass into the paint, now outside to Vida. Three on the way, missed. Rebound back tapped and taken by Slovenia. Now another drive. Circus shot won't go. Out of bounds, it'll be USA ball. Anthony says shout out from Loveland, Colorado. Bobby's watching from Albania. Everyone watching from Latvia. We're in Kingston, Jamaica. Luis Correa watching from Venezuela. Oh, love visiting Venezuela a few years ago. Hope everything's gotten better for you folks down there. Lyrics Master in the Philippines. They're getting ready for the World Cup. in the chat shouting for Omaha Bilyeu to come in for Team USA. No doubt we will see him. Nicholas watching from Italy. We were just in Italy in March. First time there. Beautiful. We Liddy watching from Beijing. Had a chance to visit Beijing in 2015. Juan David uh, Cantillo Villa Nueva shout out from Colombia another great country that I was able to visit it's in Colombia in 2017 in Medellin someone watching from Bangladesh Giannis watching from Greece yeah big welcome to everybody jumping into the game here on our YouTube live stream Nearly 16,000 folks checking in right now. And again, if you are expecting a traditional play-by-play, -play, that's not what we do here at this level of tournaments, as well as the youth tournaments. Try to do a lot more engagement on social media with everybody watching, and we certainly appreciate all the great comments and questions in the chat. As USA pulls to within six at 49-43. Question asking if Poland is in this tournament. Poland is not in this tournament. Copy watching from Toronto. Cash watching from Minnesota. Cambodia, Gothenburg, Germany watching. Wow, watching from Salvador in Brazil. Like one from Brussels in Belgium. Sweet potato, no, I have never been to Slovenia. I certainly would love to visit, though. Layup missed by Ian Jackson. Ronnie James not playing in this tournament. Alvo watching from Guadalajara. Alfonso in Puerto Rico cheering for Slovenia. We are now up over 1,500 likes. Way to go, everybody. Question in the chat where this is being played. This is in Phonix Arena in Debrecen, Hungary. Being played in... Two sites, the other one at Ola Gabor Arena in 
Debertson. Some of my Lithuanian friends checking in. They remember me last year from the U-17 tournament. Had a lot of fun with all the Lithuanian fans. USA trailing by eight, 51-43. Three minutes to play in the third. That one popped out of there. It's going to be Slovenia ball. Bogdan watching from Romania. Viewers in Norway and Poland as well. Slovenia comes up with a loose ball. They'll get another crack at it. Layup. Block, but still goes in. Omaha Bilyeu got a piece of that. But counted for Vukosin Todorovic. Three from the corner. That's up and good. Omaha Bilyeu gets USA back to within seven. 53-46. Inside 220 to play. But there is a nice dunk. Sergei Matsura scores again. Matsura 16 points on 6 of 8 shooting. He's also got 3 rebounds and 2 assists. Bounce inside. Eric Daly Jr. draws contact on his way up. He'll go to the free throw line. Daly one of two from the stripe in this game. Alvaro watching from Bolivia in South America. Constantinos watching from Cyprus. Seth, I think it's a little too early to say, is this the dagger? <laughs> Thanos watching from Thessaloniki. And starting to wonder why Team USA has not started to use the full court press. We will see if they go to that. Toby Awaka, the only American in double figures with 12 points. He's also got eight rebounds. Eric Daly has nine. For Slovenia, Sergei Matsura, 16 points. Jan Vida with 13. Slovenia continuing to lead despite being out-rebounded by USA, 35-26. Both teams taking pretty good care of the ball. USA with 10 turnovers so far, Slovenia with 8. going to be a lane violation. Question asking what the yellow and red dashes on the screen are. That indicates the number of team fouls by each team in the quarter. Holly watching from Cardiff in Wales. Another viewer in the Philippines. Miles Colvin comes up a little gingerly after coming in contact with the display board, but he's going to stay in. Chris watching from Perth in Australia. Slovenia continues to lead. The foul's going to be on Awaka. You foul the Two penalties.
Adam watching in Malaysia, saying it's 3 a.m. in Malaysia. My goodness. That's true dedication. Appreciate all the great fans we have all over the world watching this game and this tournament. More than 1,700 likes on the broadcast, nearly 19,000 viewers on our YouTube live stream. Oklahoma State Athletics says we want number six, Eric Daly Jr. Eric has played 14 minutes in this game. He's got nine points, four rebounds, one assist, and one steal. The free throw is good. And again, I'm trying to keep up with the uh, the chat on our YouTube live stream, but it's going so fast. Sometimes it's hard to respond because they're going so fast. Every once in a while, get to shout one out, but. <laughs> Tough to do that, watch stats, keep, uh, keep track of the game as well. USA pulls back to within 10. Got a viewer in the Caribbean, Trinidad and Tobago. Catch and shoot, three pointer no good. Back into the corner. Boy looked like Todorovic stepped on the sideline as he started that drive. Another offensive rebound. The foul won't go, but that means a trip to the free throw line. Foul whistled on Omaha Bilyeu. as the first free throw falls through. Just the first foul on Omaha Bilyeu. Ryan watching in Honolulu, Evan from Tucson. Here comes Dylan Harper, he goes off the glass and in. Nice attack by Dylan Harper. And the USA back to within nine. 25 seconds to play, third quarter. Still watching from Rome. Made my first visit to Rome in March. Just an amazing city. Long three pointer. Missed, but a foul call. And. Lukosin Todorovic will go to the free throw line for three free throws. Kevin Young watching from Hong Kong. What do you think, everybody? Coming here to the end of the third quarter. I think Slovenia can hold on. There's a look at Daniel Radosovjevic. So Todorovic hits two out of three free throws. Stefan watching from Serbia. One other game going on right now. We'll update you on that when we get a moment as there's a whistle as USA tries to bring it into the front court. 14 fouls, Madagascar and Lebanon have gone final. Madagascar wins that game, 
to 66. USA will play Lebanon on Tuesday. Slovenia will play Madagascar tomorrow, an off day here at the 2023 FIBA U19 Basketball <laughs> World Cup. An off day, but not really an off day. You know all these players will be getting a run in, getting a little sweat going. FIBA staff, the LOC, everybody going to be working to make sure everything is squared away for the final few days of this event. In two different sites here in Phoenix Arena in Debertson and also at Olagabor Arena. Second free throw falls in. <laughs> Nearly a miracle tip in at the end of the third quarter. But heading to the fourth, Slovenia leads by the score of 61 52. We are back with fourth quarter action live from Phonics Arena in Debertson at the 2023 FIBA U19 Basketball World Cup. Back in just a few moments. Welcome back to Phonics Arena in Debertson. Heading into the fourth quarter. Final game of the day. Slovenia leading USA 60-52. The tip won't go. The second effort won't go. And that's going to be Slovenia ball as a couple of players collide and go out of bounds. Alan Zulich and Dylan Harper both picked off the hardwood. Both teams, both players rather, seem just fine. 
Welcome in if you're just joining us. My name's Craig Feta. Hope you've been enjoying this one so far. Slovenia. This would be an upset should they win this game. Strong under the basket. Miha Music. Three at the other end up in good. Trey Johnson strikes. Trey Johnson, three of four from three-point range yesterday. That was Trey Johnson's first three points of this game. We are watching from Medellin, Colombia. Got a chance to visit there a few years ago. Medellin, a very beautiful city. Wonderfully friendly people as well. Arne Osoynik commits the foul there. If you have not already, go ahead and let us know where you're watching from. Try to give you a shout out, but it just goes by so fast. My mouth can't keep up with my eyes. Nice feed underneath as Van Allen Lubin goes up and stuffs that home with two hands. 63-57 now. 5-2 run by USA to open this fourth quarter. And Slovenia wants timeout. Welcome back to Phonics Arena in Debritson, USA trying to claw back into this one. It's trailing by six now, 63-57. You are checking in from Wisconsin. Mitch says, hello, my bro commentator from Serbia, Belgrade. Boston, the Philippines, Stockholm, Sweden. Mila says she's upset because Lebanon losing, but she's still here watching for me. Oh, I appreciate that, Mila. That's very nice of you. Another viewer in Finland. More folks from Lebanon checking in on this game after... Their team lost to Madagascar just a little bit ago. Wraparound pass outside. And an offensive foul. Offensive foul. That's going to be on Sergei Matsura. says regards from Slovenia emphasis on love JM Cruz watching from New York Ezekiel Vialona from Dominican Republic you are in Vienna that's a city I would very much like to see Vienna Austria you are in Berlin Up over 2,000 likes on the broadcast now. Thank you so much, everybody. We're going to try to get to 2,500 on this one. Spin move into the lane. Beautiful drive there by Dylan Harper. And USA trails by four. 
Saw somebody check in from Leeds in the UK. I was there many, many years ago. That shot swatted into the press area. Checking in from Dominican Republic. Finger roll won't go. Second effort, no. USA running. Trailing by six. Three on the way. Just missed. Gasper Skoryans pulls down the rebound, and here comes Slovenia back the other way. Urakan says, don't call it a comeback. They've been here for years. A little Pillil Cool J. Shot clock at five. Strong work in the paint by Jan Zemic, but he could not finish. Would be watching from the Solomon Islands. Coach Marulanda watching in Oxford in the UK. Ray Johnson gets USA back to within two. 65-63 now, six and a half minutes to play in this fourth quarter. Teresa and Roman watching from the Czech Republic. Three on the way, no good for Masura, and a foul on the rebound. Didn't see much contact there for a foul. In Estonia, one in Krakow. Josef watching in Zurich, Switzerland. Pull up from 14, no good. Rebound, Van Allen Lubin. Here comes USA looking to tie. Pass just a little bit too far ahead for Van Allen Lubin. Yeah, a couple of uh, questions on that last foul call. I, I agree with that. I didn't see much there. But we're watching on screens and tablets and mobile devices. They are there and in person with a much better view than we have. Let's drive into the lane. Shot blocked. Up ahead to Asa Newell. Gets it back to Van Allen Lubin. And we are tied at 65. Five and a half minutes to play in fourth quarter. Ashen Basket says, hello from France. I love this game. Well, we sure do too. And we've got a good one brewing here as Slovenia turns it over. You are in Gdansk, Poland. Mitchellstown, Ireland checking in. For those of you just jumping in, if you haven't already, go ahead and give us that thumbs up on the stream. More than 2,200 likes, nearly 23,000 watching right now. Even if just 10% of you hit that thumbs up, we'll more than double our like total. Sure would appreciate that. Feet underneath. From Johnson to Boswell, now outside to Harper. Three-pointer missed. Rebound grabbed by Newell. Here's Boswell, step back from outside the left elbow. Splash that! USA on top now, 67-65. First lead for Team USA since the first quarter. Matthew watching from Cannes in France. Enrique from Marbella, Spain. Three-pointer rolls off left side. Rebound tracked down in the corner. Bounce pass into the lane. Too strong on the layup. USA now looking to extend.
strong work into the lane, but a travel called. Toby Awaka can't really see the feet there, but that official was right on it. Michel Hanush says Lebanon will beat USA tomorrow. Well, we'll see. Zach says Slovenia is feeling the pressure now. USA on top by two, coming up on four minutes to play. For the stats on this game, as well as tournament highlights, recaps, and other news. Head to the official tournament website, u19worldcup.basketball, and subscribe to FIBA the Basketball channel on YouTube. Just search FIBA U19 World Cup. Subscribe and don't miss a minute of the remainder of this tournament, as well as great content for the remainder of this summer. Tomorrow, an off day here in Debertson. Slovenia will take on Madagascar on Tuesday. USA, meanwhile, will take on Lebanon. Those two teams just finished tangling a little while ago. Madagascar defeated Lebanon 83-66. Julian says, easy game for Lebanon on Tuesday. <laughs> you have just asked, where is this tournament held in? It is in Debrecen, Hungary. We are in Phoenix Arena. The other site for this tournament in Debrecen is Olagabor Arena. Yeah, we're up near 2,500 likes. Three-pointer on the way, a little too strong for Trey Johnson. Rebound pulled down. Now Slovenia looking to regain the lead. Seth says, watch out for that Madagascar Penguin lineup. Yeah, those guys are ferocious. As Jan Vide puts Slovenia back on top, 69-67. Stolen away, Slovenia running. And now USA with the steal. Tylen Boswell pulls that out of there and a foul. 13 foul, Slovenia. Kenneth watching from United Arab Emirates. Question in the chat, how am I liking Hungary? I'm not actually in Hungary. I am in my home studio in Bloomington, Illinois. I am watching this game remotely just like the rest of you. I've got the game up on a big screen. I've got the YouTube chat going right next to that. Nice finish there. Ray Johnson now as USA squared up at 69. Johnson with nine points now. Illinois asks if I'm in the stadium. I am not in the stadium. I am several thousand miles away. Legend Born today asks, how is it different from FIBA versus NBA rules? There's just a few subtle differences. As Kylan Boswell finishes, the main ones, the unsportsmanlike call on a breakaway, the 14-second reset, reset on the shot clock on an offensive rebound. And the ability to take a ball off the rim defensively once it hits. Those are the ones that mostly come into play. USA back on top. Just inside two minutes to play. 71. Actually, we're tied at 71. <laughs> Lost track of the score for the moment while I was looking at all the comments and questions in the chat, but a timeout on the floor. We're tied at 71 when we resume. We need character. We need chemistry. 
FIBA Basketball World Cup is the peak of the game. It's the toughest competition in the basketball world to win. That is why I will be there. Because when you win for one, you win for all. One minute, 59 seconds left to play in regulation in the fourth quarter, tied up at 71 between Slovenia and USA. Slovenia took the lead in the first quarter and held it until about halfway through the fourth quarter. And now we are tied at 71. My name's Craig Fade. I hope you've been enjoying this one. USA trying to make the comeback. Toby Awaka off the glass and in. And now with 1.48 to play, Slovenia takes timeout. Tim Bryan asks if the coaches have to play different players during the course of the game. Nope, they're not required to play a certain number of players. Not required to play everybody on the team. So you'll see stat lines where there's a DNP coach's decision. As we check out some of the highlights. See the two-hand stuff by Van Allen Lubin. Step back from Kylan Boswell. Jan Vida having himself a nice game. I appreciate that. <laughs> I, am, I am not half American, half Turkish. I am 100% American. <laughs> but I work very hard on trying to pronounce the names correctly. Away, watching from Lausanne, Switzerland. Toxic asks if there's an app to look up the scores and stats. Yeah, you can go to the official tournament website, u19worldcup.basketball. Another question are all the refs from Europe? No, Leonardo Salazar is from Argentina in this game, and Carlos Velez is from Colombia. So we've got two South American officials working this game. 73-71 USA, a minute 20 to play in the fourth quarter. USA just about half of what they scored yesterday against Madagascar. A loner wolf tuning in from Palmdale. Call it east side Palmdale. Limerick, Ireland. Beverly Hills. Finland. Connecticut. New Zealand. Eight to shoot for USA. Here comes Awaka into the lane. Kicks it out. Three on the shot clock. Three for Boswell. No good. Rebound to Waka. Goes up strong. Can't get it. But there for the tip. Eric Daly Jr. Gives USA a four-point lead. 75-71. 45 seconds to play. We're into the corner. Here's Matsura on the drive and a foul called. You're in 
and San Francisco, one in Tucson, a couple in Lebanon. Frank Messer watching in Budapest. And Team USA wants timeout. Tutorul watching from Oxnard, California. Norwalk, Connecticut. And again, everybody, <laughs> I'm so sorry if I can't get to all of the comments. They just scroll by so fast. I did see somebody's watching from about 100 miles north of me, straight up I-39. USA has taken the lead. 31 seconds to play. Nearly 28,000 folks viewing on our live stream right now on YouTube. Over 2,700 likes. If you haven't already, go ahead and give us that thumbs up. YouTube live stream. Sure would appreciate it. Sure appreciate all the great comments and questions coming in on the stream. Russell says he's watching from USA. You've got to admit he's excited about Jan Vida. He is indeed a fantastic player. Mr. Bo 5001 says he's in Romeoville, Illinois. I played a football game in Romeoville once. <laughs> Second free throw missed. Rebound goes out of bounds, and that's going to be USA ball. 28 seconds to play. Question in the chat about the foul count. USA whistled for 18 fouls. Slovenia whistled for 18 fouls. 16 seconds to play and a whistle. As Slovenia was getting the offense set up. It's going to be on Mark Armstrong. Saw him reach in. says, come on, one more basket, USA. Shot clock is off. Game clock at 10. Ball's on the floor, and now USA has it. Slovenia's got to find somebody to foul. USA too quick. And finally, Sergei Matsura commits the foul with just three seconds left. USA did a fantastic job keeping the ball away from somebody trying to commit the foul. So Trey Johnson will go to the free throw line to try to ice this. One free throw makes it a two possession game. And there it is. Three seconds left. Slovenia now trailing by four. Leon Volancic says, I'm from Slovenia. Can you please shout me out? Sure thing, Leon. Second free throw is good, and the lead is five with three seconds to play. Indeed, a lot of respect to Slovenia. People making the comments in the chat. Slovenia did indeed play a great game. USA just too strong down the stretch. Three 
Three seconds to play. And USA leads by five. Let's try to get over 3,000 likes. Got Still got a few seconds to do that. More than 24,000 people watching right now. If you haven't already, please go ahead and give us that thumbs up. You can also check in on Facebook and Instagram at Next Gen Hoops for more content on all these fantastic young athletes on both the men's and women's side. And don't forget to subscribe to FIBA the Basketball channel on YouTube. Search FIBA, 19, uh, FIBA U19 World Cup and subscribe. Slovenia needs pretty well a miracle here, and they're not going to get one. Team USA with the comeback win, 77-72. USA outscores Slovenia 25-11 in the fourth quarter to come away with the win. Congratulations for the reigning champion and also for Team Slovenia because an excellent fight. USA scores 60 points fewer than they did yesterday in the win over Madagascar, but all that counts is the win in the win column. A great effort by Slovenia. These teams, as well as all the other teams, will have a day off tomorrow. Slovenia will face Madagascar on Tuesday. USA will take on Lebanon. Checking the final numbers. Matsura finished with 19 points, five rebounds, two assists for Slovenia. Osoynik had seven. Jan Vide finished with 17 points, three rebounds, five assists. Zemlich had seven. Belko, six for Slovenia. Mušek had four. Todorovic had eight, and Zulic had four. For USA, Mark Armstrong, five points. Toby Awaka, double-double, 14 points, 11 boards. Kylan Boswell had eight. Eric Daly Jr., 11. Trey Johnson, 11. Omaha Bilyeu, three points. Dylan Harper, 10. Ian Jackson, two. Van Allen Lubin, four. Asa Newell, five. And Cody Williams had four. USA moves to 2-0 on the tournament. Slovenia falls to 1-1. Again, a big thank you to everybody watching. More than 3,200 likes on this one. Appreciate all the engagement on social media. My name's Craig Feta. Tournament resumes on Tuesday. This is the 2023 FIBA U19 Basketball World Cup live from Debrecen, in Hungary. For everybody at FIBA and Spalk, my name is Craig Feta. Thanks so much for watching. So long until next time.